I know. Everybody wants to know this question. I'm like, can I live? No! <laughs> no! You cannot! You have to answer! That's what life in the limelight looks like. Everyone wants to know your business. Well, as some would say, that's the price of fame. Now, like always, eyes are on Simone Biles, even if it is still technically the off-season. So what's actually up with her? Besides the fame brought about by her seemingly endless number of gold medals from various major events, she is also known for being vocal about her mental health struggles and how best to address them. Biles' decision to prioritize her mental well-being after her Twisties incident in Tokyo sparked vital conversations about the immense pressure athletes face and their mental health challenges. Since then, she has become an advocate for mental health. I'm making a bigger effort to take care of my mind and my body, which includes therapy once a week," Biles explained in an interview. Success to me means something a little bit different now, she further stated. Before everybody defined success for me, even though I had my own narrative. Now, it's about showing up, being in a good mental space, having fun, and letting whatever happens happen. Speaking of which, Simone Biles is in between career moves at the moment. Following another super successful Olympic Games over the summer, Biles has added more gold medals to her already impressive collection. Not content with just the medals, she launched the Gold Over America Tour with other high-profile gymnasts, which ran for seven weeks and recently came to a close. The Gold Over America Tour, or GOAT, is a popular show where superstar gymnasts like Simone Biles show their jaw-dropping flips and skills. It started in mid-September and ended in early November, after hitting 32 big arenas all over the US. Reminiscent of the success of her 2021 GOAT Tour, Simone brought back her grand finale to the iconic Little Caesars Arena. The GOAT herself had an emotional reaction as she reached the conclusion of her tour. Last show day, bittersweet. Biles posted to Instagram, before later adding a photo of her, Chylas, and Robertson watching themselves on the big screen at the Little Caesars Arena in Detroit. In a post on Instagram chronicling highlights from the tour, which also featured fellow Olympic gold medalists Jordan Chylas and Hesley Rivera, Biles offered up a heartfelt message about her gold journey this year. Seven weeks, countless memories, and endless gratitude. Thank you to everyone who came out and supported this journey after the success we had in Paris. Your energy and love fuel everything I do. Forever thankful, forever inspired, stay golden. The seven-time Olympic gold medalist captioned the post. Biles has documented every step of the tour, including backstage snapshots, photos with fellow members of Team USA, and multiple visits from her husband, Chicago Bears player Jonathan Owens. Speaking of Owens, some of you have probably heard the rumor surrounding the couple. Some say that there could be a baby in the way for the happy couple. With three more gold medals to her name and hints of retirement, many fans are beginning to wonder if Biles could be pregnant with her first child between her and her husband after they tied the knot last year. It is no secret that Simone and Jonathan both admitted that they want to have kids and they're seeking two or three of them. However, there is absolutely no indication that she is pregnant. After all, Biles performed a tour de force in the City of Love at the 2024 Olympic Games, where she claimed gold in the team's final, vault and all around. Not to mention, she just finished her GOAT tour Additionally, Owens was just traded from the Green Bay Packers to the Chicago Bears in the NFL, so he will be busy adjusting to a new training camp, new venue, and new city to live in as he pursues his own dream of becoming a Super Bowl champion. In connection to this, though, Biles is likely to face a lonely Christmas without her husband. As Jonathan focuses on the NFL, the gymnastics star takes on a festive competition and wins hearts with her community efforts. What's that about, you may ask? Well, while Owens is entrenched in football training for a December 26 showdown against the Seattle Seahawks, Biles has embraced her own kind of game-spreading holiday cheer in Houston. Sure, it's tough being apart, but we've been through this before. We always make it work, Biles has said about their long-distance struggles. On that note, Dick's Sporting Goods has tapped Biles as part of its holiday campaign this year where athletes across Texas compete for the title of Holiday Decorating Officer. 
As part of the challenge, Biles adorned her local store with creative Christmas flair, including golden goat figurines, a nod to her legendary greatest of all time status, and an array of festive pine trees. A $100,000 Sports Matter grant, courtesy of Dick's Sporting Goods Foundation, will accompany the campaign, empowering Biles to support youth sports programs in Houston. I'm excited to give back to the community this way, she shared, highlighting her commitment to inspiring the next generation. Biles isn't the only star aiming for the coveted title. Competing alongside her are Dak Prescott from the Dallas Cowboys, Chris Paul of the San Antonio Spurs, and Quinn Ewers from the Texas Longhorns. Each athlete represents their city, and the ultimate winner will be chosen based on creativity and fan participation. Despite the miles between her and Owens this holiday season, Biles continues to embrace the festive spirit. It's all about spreading joy and making others happy, she remarked, a sentiment that resonates in her charitable efforts and holiday campaign. Unsurprisingly, for Biles, this Christmas isn't just about overcoming distance, but finding new ways to shine on and off the mat. You should know, though, if you didn't already, that that's not the only thing Simone will be busy with. The United States star gymnast recently made an appearance at the Country Music Awards. As a matter of fact, she turned heads with a new look and later announced the finalists for one of the awards. It was the first of what will be two TV appearances in less than a week. You heard that right. According to a report from the Associated Press, the seven-time gold medalist landed a new TV job. She'll be partnering with Snoop Dogg as a mentor for NBC's The Voice in an episode airing soon. We were able to riff off each other and give the artist the best insight going into the next round, Biles shared. It was pretty easy, simple. Biles added of the relationship she developed with Snoop Dogg. We're both very mellow, but if we need to bring that energy up, then we can. For us, it was about instilling confidence going into the next week. These are the learning steps. Learn, process, go back in, and work, she said. They all have the vocal talent. It's about harnessing that, knowing when to bring it out and which songs to sing, and which genre you fit in, and what you want your legacy to be. This is truly a special show as well as the judging. They don't get to see the physical appearance first. It's all off of ears, listening and putting their craft together as well. As for Snoop Dogg, he knows Biles is the best at what she does. Perform under the brightest lights. We have the best experience and knowledge to give to these performers, he said. She's a performer. I'm a performer. We've performed under extreme conditions. We always do our best. That much is true, and you know it. Basically, Simone will act as a playoff advisor. She will offer guidance to aspiring vocalists alongside Snoop. The pairing is a natural one, as both share a history of thriving under pressure. Here's another athlete who's no stranger to pressure. 